The Met 365 Summer Handicap is next. This is a mile and three quarters, 0 to 100. Alexander Palace at the top for Paul Rhodes. Ticket o'clock, Joshua Southern for Finter Morton. David, Rob- David Robertson, Al Manzor, Dan Hughes, Clara Amazon. Graham Clutterbuck, Locomotive Leipzig, Padraig Hogan. Seventh Bride for Martin Little. Still game, Alex Cherry, Guitain Approach. Or in McMilk Star, Delhi Alex Cherry, stood in fourth, Satyam, Spread Eagles, Graham Clutterbuck, Digamist Go Lightly, in McMilk, Deputy Bill, Stu Gray, Minus Thomas Rogers, Nashville Cracker, Vinnie Gerard, Jack Cherry, Stu Gray, and R's Life, Thomas Rogers. So 18 again in this one, 18 in this, another big field. And away they go. And Gitane approaches a little bit slower. Closest to us, the grey Jack Cherry, one of the first out, and also right over on the far round Nashville Cracker. But now, between the two of them at the centre of the track, it looks like it's going to be R's life and stunning force, and they're going to break into the lead. And stunning force it is then, it's just about in front from R's life, and quit an approach, it was slowly away, and it's now very quickly got up to get a challenge in for the lead. Clara Amazon's back in fourth, then Jack Cherry and Al Manzor with still game behind that one, and then seventh Bride, then comes Spread Eagle and Tick of the Clock. It's always the back star, Delhi. It's just about the back market. It's Stunning Force in the lead. From Gwitain approach second and R's life third. A little bit of a gap into Still Game who heads Jack Cherry and Al Manzor, Clara Amazon and Seventh Bride. And on the inside is Spread Eagle. And Alexandra Palace is also in a decent enough position with on its outside for Finta Morton. Star Diddy and Locomotive Leipzig are the two who are currently out the back. And in well inside the final mile now. Still in force. This is another one for Satyam and he's got under the under the handicapper's radar. The leads by about a length to R's life in second. Al Manzor in third down well. Then comes Gwitain approaching, still going Jack Cherry, Clara Amazon. And seventh bride now trying to come around the outside. Then comes for Finta Morton. Weird. Alexander Palace still there as well. Inside the final five now and stunning force from R's life. In Almanzor, Jack Cherry, seventh bright on the outside. In still game, Gwitain approach. It's wide open this one. They've got to get to stunning force though still. It's a difficult horse to pass and he's now going on again. He's too clear. He's too clear of the hard chasing still game. Seventh Bride now gets in to overdrive on the outside. Then Jack Cherry, Al Manzor, Clara Amazon. Still plenty in with chances. They come down towards the final two furlongs in there. And Stunning Force is in the lead. But he's being chased hard by still game. Seventh Bride just gone out like a light. It's Stunning Force in the lead from still game. Al Manzor, Jack Cherry. It's Stunning Force from Perry the Raiders. But now Al Manzor looking could be too strong. It's Al Manzor coming up the centre of the track. Furlong to go. Al Manzor, Stunning Force fights back though. Here comes Alexander Palace. It's Stunning Force still in the lead, racing up towards the line. It's going to be Stunning Force. It's going to be another one for Satyam towards the line. It's Stunning Force takes it from Alexander Palace. Al Manzor gets an approach. Jack Cherry, seventh broad drop right out to be almost last. And Stunning Force. Let's hope I've not made the same mistake as I did the other day. And it's a Padraig Hogan, it's not, it's a sack. Yeah, another one of his well handicapped snips takes it. Alexander Palace for Paul Rhodes, second. Almanzor Dan Hughes, third. Gwitain approach in McMilk, fourth. And Jack Cherry for Stu Gray was fifth.